Hello, let's have a look at this seven segment display. Now what I've got at the moment, four wires connected. There are four wires. This is for the most significant bit, that's the eights line. Then we've got the fours line, the twos line, and the ones line on the top there. And I've just simply taken them over to the data switches at the bottom down here. So we have the fours, twos, ones uh, line, and the, the eight line on the left hand side. Let's just move the one line up, and guess what? We just get, we get a number one there. If we just put that back down again, we go back to zero, push up the twos line, we get a two. Push up the fours line, we get a four. Push up the eights line, we get an eight. And guess what? This is like a pocket calculator. Hey everybody, what is four plus one? Five. You've just put a four in there, a one there, four plus one is five. So, five minus four is one. One plus two is three. Two, three minus one is two. And we could say 2 plus 4 is 6, and you can play around like this. Let's just say 6 minus 2 is 4, and 4 minus 4 is 0. You just add in 8, add in 1, you've got 9. There you are. So you can do all those things. Now, you don't just need to use these data switches. Let's take out the 1's line. So take out the 1's line. Now, actually, if you don't put an input in, it looks like a logic high. That's a funny thing about a lot of logic ICs. Even with no connection, it looks like there's a logic one there. But let's have some fun. Let's connect it to the clock. Now it's going from odd number to even number. So if we then take off the eight, it's not one, put in the four, it's going to four, five, four, five, and so on. You want to slow things down a bit? Easy. We just simply put a little test pen screwdriver into the little control. We can slow it right down for you. There you are. Nice and easy.